Hello and welcome back. Today we are going to install a Cardo Pack Talk Bold in a Schubert helmet. These videos are sponsored by PacMoto Tours, so come check us out at PacMotoTours.com or check out the online part store for your BMW R1200, R1250, RT, and GS maintenance needs at PacMotoTours.com slash store. All right, if you like these videos, would love it if you would give us a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. Here you'll find all sorts of content about uh, motorcycle maintenance projects from changing oil to replacing brakes, bleeding brakes, uh, replacing air filters, so on and so forth. So come subscribe to uh, this channel and check out these videos. Okay, as I said, we are going to install a Cardo Pack Talk Bold uh, in a Schubert helmet. As you can see, I've already done it twice in um, this uh, Women's C3 Pro, my wife's helmet here, and in my E1. Um, so I've done it twice. I'm now going to install it for a friend in, uh, in her C3 Pro. So uh, let's go jump in and get started. Okay, we're going to start by unpacking this uh, pack talk bold so so here we go we have the device itself our charging cable some instructions a sticker We have mounting options here, speakers. Uh, this is to clip on the side of the helmet. This isn't going to work for the Schubert helmet, so set that aside. And then, of course, our uh, boom mic is in there. Let's see if I have anything else. Nope, that is it. So. Um, Here's everything in our kit, and uh, let's get started installing. So the place that I found is best for this device is right here, just behind the uh, slider for uh, your sun visor. So right in that area there. And I misspoke earlier when I said we're not going to use this. What I meant was... We're not going to use the, uh, the clip here, so I need to take this clip off so that it will clip uh, into this uh, the sticky pad that will mount to the side of the helmet. This here is for a different kind of helmet where you can slide the whole thing in underneath the side piece, and that's just not an option for, uh, for the, pack, for the, uh, the Schubert helmet. So uh, let me go ahead and uh, take off this clip. You can see a little indentation here that we need to press to remove the clip. There you go, I just pressed that in and removed it. So the ways that this goes together inside the helmet, you can see the speakers plug into there. The microphone plugs into here. I'm not going to snap it in tightly right now because I don't want to have to disconnect it later. Okay, but give it a little start. This is the sticky pad that will hold on our, uh, our device here. And then the Cardo Pack Talk Bold snaps in there. So that is how it all goes together inside, okay? Let's clean off our mounting area with this alcohol pad. So we'll get this area in here nice and clean. And we'll let that dry. Okay. Once we put on this, once we put on this sticky pad, it needs to set for 24 hours before you can use the helmet. So keep that in mind um, when you do your project. 
before we install the, uh, the glue plate, as Cardo likes to call it, uh, make sure that you see this is the bottom end, the solid side, not this side with the groove, because if you can see, uh, this bracket slides right down on top of it. So this flat side goes on the bottom, okay? Okay, our alcohol pad has dried, so pull that off. You do not want to touch it with your fingers because that will damage the glue. So again, I like it just behind the uh, sun visor slider. So I'm gonna mount this in there just like this. There's a little ridge here on the Schubert, so it kind of goes just underneath that ridge. Uh, we're going to get that pressed down really nice and tight. Remember, I've got that flat edge at the bottom, so this piece will snap right in when we're ready. Okay, we're going to let that set now for 24 hours. We can continue the project, just don't use your helmet and start bouncing around and putting stress on the glue before 24 hours. We're going to continue the project now. Okay, here's a pretty good spot so I can show you everything. So the first thing we'll do is unsnap uh, these two spots here. Okay, those taken out. There are small pins in this collar that point up into here, so don't break those when you pull them apart. You have to pull back a little bit to release these pins before I can take the rest of it apart. See if you can see right there, right in here there's a little plastic molding. At the very end of this is a pin that sticks up in, okay? Again, that pin's right in there. So let's see if I can release this gently. There it is. See that pin right there? See that? Okay. And then this collar just comes around. There's a pin on this side too. So again, there's these two pins I'm talking about. One's right there and one's on the other side. Okay. Set my collar aside. And now, see it might be better to see it from this side. Now, inside the helmet, right there where it's red, those are snapped so I can unsnap those. Okay, we don't really need that tag. There's another snap right here. Okay, that unsnaps. We'll do the same on this side, so we're going to unsnap and unsnap, okay? The only way to get, you have to take these, these uh, the, the helmet latch out uh, to get access and pull all this out to take all of it out, but we don't really need to do that. I just needed access so that I can get in here to the speaker. Uh, wells on each side and to be able to mount the uh, microphone. Okay, we've got a good view there. So remember our mounting plate will slide onto here. I still have my microphone plugged in. Let me unplug that for now. It will slide in like this. I'm not going to clip it in now. And I'm going to use this space I hope right down here, see, I got all that space in there. I'm going to use that space to tuck all the cables down between this uh, liner and the helmet shell. You could also see we've got the two speakers. So one's on a short cord, one's on a long. The long is going to go on the opposite side of the electronics. The short will go over here. So I'm going to feed this uh, the, the long side in first 
because um, I think that's the one that's a little bit more difficult because we've got to feed it. I'm going to feed it all around again between this, this shell underneath uh, these two uh, straps here and all the way back around so I can hide that, that wire as well. Uh, these have a little Velcro patch on them so we can install the Velcro inside of uh, the ear wells as well so that there's room so that these stick and stay into place. There's enough room for these to slide uh, back and forward so that you can find your own comfort zone. On my E1 I have the the JBL speakers. These are the JBLs as well. I found they put a little pressure on my ear so I used a Dremel and uh, carved out a little bit of this area here to make the, uh, the uh, speakers more recessed into uh, the helmet. I'm going to install these two Velcro patches inside the ear wells. That's what allows the speakers to stick inside here. There's one there. Hopefully you can see, I think so. I put these in the middle so that you have room to move the speakers all over the place depending on your personal desires. Okay, so those are both in place. Back to the far side. We'll find me a good way to hide all these wires. Let me get this pulled around. Get an initial spot for the speaker. I'm going to put it up in its frontmost position to start with. Okay, so that's that. It's underneath the liner there. Okay. Stick this speaker in as well. You can see it's going to go up in the very front. Okay. So I have some extra cordage. Okay. As I said before, we're going to try to tuck all that right down in this open space right there. Before I do that, I'm going to mount the boom. So the boom is two, is two pieces. There's this attachment piece and then uh, the, where the microphone gets attached again for a little bit additional support. So something like here and here so that that microphone comes out about to the middle of your mouth. That actually might be a little still far out. See if I can pull it back just a little bit more. Okay. So here's two more Velcro pads. As you can see, that's way more than I need there and more than I need there. So I'm going to cut this one in half and work with uh, just one of them for now. So now that I've cut it in half, these are going to work really well. One there and one right there. So that's going to be good. So let's remove the sticky back. Make sure I have my spotter. Okay. This up here for the microphone. Okay. <clears throat> this will go. Let's get this one in first. Then this one. Okay, see how that works like that? Get you a nice close-up view in there. 
here's our mounting bracket okay that's got the leads on it so one of these leads is going to snap into the microphone so let's get that make sure i got it set the right direction yes i do okay that snaps in tight plug in our speakers here okay like that I'm not going to snap this all the way into place yet. You can see I've just kind of gently put it into its spot so I can work on arranging these cables all down inside this, this helmet here. So I'm going to take a little bit and just try to shove all that stuff down here. Yeah, that looks pretty good, huh? All right, I'm gonna snap this in just so I can, there he goes, that's all I needed. So I got these two wires are all that come in to the helmet. You can see now, got the speaker wire comes in here, this microphone wire and its connector all gets tucked down in there. The other speaker wire is all the way around here, back to that side. So now I'm going to snap some cheek pads back together. Remember, this collar has these indentations that slide right up under there into this little spot right here. I'm going to get you a close-up so you can see. It goes, it goes in this track and then right in that spot right there. sides in so I'm gonna snap this plastic bead around okay do you see we've got that in okay these cables come right down here there's a little bit of this spot where this plastic ribbing, I suppose I could put a little notch in it uh, just to create a little gap for these wires to go down. <clears throat> but since it's not my helmet, I'm not going to do that. All right. These little guys snap back into place. Okay, there we go. All right, so there's our boom microphone installed. Close the helmet up. Um, I'm going to let this continue drying, so I'm not going to mount the pack talk bold on the helmet yet I want to give this a full 24 hours to uh, to set before I snap this in it puts a little bit of, of pressure on it 
So, uh, Cardo Pack Talk Bold installation on a Schuberth helmet uh, completed. So, again, if you like this video, uh, please give us a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe to this channel. Tons of videos on maintenance projects uh, for your R1200. Uh, GS and RT motorcycles, oil changes, air filters, spark plugs, 6K, 12K, uh, all kinds of videos, uh, other stuff as well. So uh, again, these videos are sponsored by PacMoto Tours, so come check us out at PacMotoTours.com and the online part store at PacMotoTours.com store. Thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks.